has family members, they'll find a way to spit it for you. <laughs> oh All right. God. Well, Chelsea, it's just so yucky today. I know. Yeah. Gray skies, yeah. rain, but today I get to talk about things looking up. Nice. Whereas yesterday I had to say, you know what, the rain's coming. But yeah. totally different story today. So things are looking much better as we end the work week and especially as we head into the weekend. Let's get started taking a live look at Center City. And yes, indeed, those roads are wet and those skies are gray, but that'll be changing, especially by the weekend. We have to talk about the rain first, though, as we check out storm scan. Yeah, there's still more of it coming and some of the heaviest downpours can be expected, especially west of the city between now and about 10 p.m. Although we are starting to see things break up a bit down into Delaware, also into South Jersey, but also some areas with some heavier downpours that we're keeping a very close eye on located up to our north and west. So here's the big picture. The system beginning to spin its way on out. It's going to push up to the north and east and as it does, it'll actually intensify and that's going to bring us quite a bit of wind heading into Friday and also Saturday. We have a flood watch in effect through six o'clock tomorrow morning. We also have a coastal flood advisory. Now high tide for our shore points that'll be occurring between about 830 and 930 tonight. So there could be some minor tidal flooding that you'll have to watch out for. Otherwise, here's how things play out through the night. And I've kind of put on wind direction here as well, just to show you how that wind is going to come into play. So here we are at 11 o'clock tonight. We start to see things beginning to taper to some showers, especially in and around Philadelphia. Look at this by 6 a.m. Those winds completely switch direction coming out of the north and west. We begin to filter in some drier air. So between about 9 and 2 p.m. during the afternoon, we're actually fairly quiet and we could see some good bits of sunshine, but then more clouds, some instability showers are going to be pouring on in by Friday afternoon afternoon with some colder air working its way in and then we dry out high pressure builds in as we head into Saturday, but the winds really are going to be picking up. So on the roads tomorrow, giving you the yellow light for both commutes, still a better situation than what we dealt with today than around noon, just mostly cloudy skies with some sunshine peeking on through, but dry during the middle part of the day. 50 right now in Philly, it's 51 in Wilmington, 51 in Millville. We've been working with temperatures that have been in the upper 40s and lower 50s pretty much all afternoon. Overnight, we'll expect rain to taper to showers. Look for low temp right around 43. Looking at 53 tomorrow, and here's how it goes one more time. Some morning showers lingering around. Then by 8, 9 o'clock, you'll start to see things drying out for a brief period of time. After 2 o'clock, we will see more scattered showers building into the picture. Temperatures around 53 by the afternoon. A big cool down on Saturday, Saturday then up to 60 Sunday and Monday. Overall, really not a bad seven-day forecast. Just a couple of ups and downs and a couple of shower chances here and there. Okay. Thank you so much, Chelsea. Appreciate that.